This is a tutorial on how to perform landing turnaround cancels with the Brigo Blaster. There's a lot of intricacies to the inputs of this stack and a lot of ways it can go wrong. I'm going to be showing inputs based on my personal control scheme shown, but the only control settings I recommend are having attack, jump, and grab on face buttons as well as shield on a trigger. The attack special smash macro is also useful for this as well as standing turnaround cancels, which I'll be covering in a separate video. The turnaround is the most difficult part, and the source of most issues. The turnaround can be input on frames 5 through 16 of the landing animation. However, the stick cannot enter the walk zone at all or else you'll begin walking. Even if you perform the 1 60th of a second smash input required, the game can read a frame during the motion and still fail it. Thankfully, you can perform the turnaround input within 8 frames beforehand, and the game will read the stick on the first available frame. With the right timing, all you have to do is tap attack and smash the stick back in one motion. Holding the attack button and pressing the later inputs too early can also make the turnaround fail. If you want to reverse the entire process, you can turn around in the air before shooting. The turnaround cancels the end leg of the blaster, but it needs to be cancelled itself. It can be cancelled from the second frame onward by dropping through a platform, jumping, shooting, or a grab or special input. While most actions in this game are bufferable, the initial shot and the action that cancels the turnaround must be timed and executed well as each frame spin eats into your advantage. Having attack, grab, and jump on face buttons allows you to input your grab or jump as quickly as you can after shooting, forces you to release the attack button, and almost ensures that you can't be too fast. Dropping through a platform doesn't seem to have any particular use, though it is technically the quickest way to get airborne, and shooting to cancel mostly just looks cool and covers both sides. When canceling with grab, take care to release the stick and tap the grab button as it's easy to buffer rolls and spot dodges. If you are using specials like Wonder Wing or Grenade, you can instead cancel with the special input itself to avoid this issue. This loses a few frames to input overhead, but grounded combos are more lenient as they don't require a jump squat. Furthermore, the attack special with Smash Macro allows you to use this method for F Smash by inputting a Wonder Wing and then pressing the A button. Canceling with jump is safer, gives you more freedom of movement, and allows you to keep the blaster out for double shots. But you lose 3 frames overall as blaster jump squad is 6 frames long as opposed to the standard 3. You can begin holding shield at any point during the input to buffer a put away on the first airborne frame. Landing turnaround cancels are very versatile and a major improvement to Brigo Blaster's strength and usage, but they still have limitations and execution barriers so I hope Nintendo won't be forced to patch them. I'll be making a follow-up video on standing turnaround cancels, which are surprisingly more difficult and restrictive but have one very good application. 